Oh my god! Oh my! No way! This kind of expressions, we're expressing a very vivid expressions. Expressing your emotions are very, very important. You come here, you could be in a, oh, I want to say something, but it's not really easy to say. So I'm going to talk about basic emotions that you're going to say, like, I'm glad, I'm sad, I'm irritated, it's bothering. So we're going to learn the basic expressions. And the other thing is we're going to learn slangs. Let's start the first one. Hol tebak. Hol tebak is showing your sympathy. Hol tebak. So there are two expressions. Hol is one and tebak is also the other one. But if you put together and then you can feel your sympathy. Hol tebak. For example, your friend said, oh my god, I passed the exam. I didn't expect it at all. And then you can say, Hol tebak. Congratulations. You can say that. Hol tebak. So you can say in a very good, good situation. So if you want to say your happiness and you can say Hol tebak with your smile. Hol tebak. It's a very showing your sympathy and it, it's showing your congratulations. But in the opposite situation, your friend is really trying hard to pass the exam. So you thought that she's going to pass the exam, but she failed. I I failed in the test. And then you can say, No way. No way. No way. I didn't expect it at all. I thought you were going to pass. And then you can say, Or just you can say, Okay? Okay? So let's repeat. In this time, hor debak is used in two situations, in a good situation or in a bad situation. So the thing that is really, really important is your facial expression. So let's do this. I passed the exam. Hor debak. And I failed the exam. Hor debak. No way. Oh my God. Okay. Good job, everyone. And let's move on to the next one. The next expression is omo, 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 or omona, omona. Okay, omo. But most of the people that you are going to see, they will use omo because omona is more like an older people expression. Omona is like a mother, father, or grandmother, grandfather expression. So, um, you it's better to say omo. Omo. Omo is like this. Today, it's a real story. So I was walking. I was walking with my friend. And then I almost slipped. I almost slipped. And I was like, oh, Omo, you're surprised. And then you say, say, Omo, Omo, like this. So you're almost slipped. And then like, it's like Korean use it unconsciously. They don't think about it. They just like, Omo, like this. Omo. So they just slipped and Omo, like this. Okay? So imagine you're walking. No, 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 let's walking. Hey, you're my friend, so come here. So we were walking, 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 and then we were almost fell. And then like, what do you say? Omo. Or omona. 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 Okay? And let's move on to the next one. The next expression is 설마요. 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 You can use in this kind of situation. Your friend, she said, Oh, I never, I never, I'm never going to marry. And then one month later, your friend came to you and then she's like, I am going to marry in one month. And I'm like, no way. You will say, no way. You said you're not going to marry. And then in this time, you can say, 설마, 설마, no way. 설마. So it's like, no way. 설마요, 설마요. So I told you, if you put yo, yo in the back, and it's a polite way. But if you're talking with your friends and delete yo, okay, delete yo. And then she said, I am going to marry in one month. And I'm like, 설마요, 설마. And it's your friend. So 설마, 설마. Okay. 
And then I'm going to tell you another expression that you can use in this situation. It's 말도 안 돼요. 말도 안 돼요. 말도 안 돼요. It means it doesn't make sense. Nonsense. I'm going to marry in one month. And I'm like, 말도 안 돼. 헐. 말도 안 돼. 말도 안 돼. Okay? 말도 안 돼. Or, I'm an older person. Older person. And then you can say, you, you can put the 요. Okay? 요. So you can say, 말도 안 돼요. 말도 안 돼요. You didn't say it. But you're going to marry in one month? 말도 안 돼. 설마. 설마. No. Like this. Okay? So you can use two expressions that if you heard that you're, you didn't expect it. And then you can say these two expressions. If you use two together, and then it makes more like flourish expression. So 설마. 설마. 말도 안 돼. Okay? Good job. And let's move on to the next one. The next expression is 심심해요. 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 심심해요 is like, I don't have anything to do. I don't have anything to do and I'm so bored. It means I am bored. So I'm bored, everyone. 심심해요. Okay? 심심해요. So there's a two same syllable. 심심해요. And then, if you are talking to your friends, if you are talking to me, and what are you going to say? Delete you, right? So only say, 심심해, 심심해. Hmm, I'm bored. 심심해, okay? <laughs> Good job. So let's review from the top in here, okay? In here. Your friend said, I passed the exam. And then you could say, 헐 대박, 헐 대박. And then your friend said, oh my god, I failed. Oh, 대박. And then you almost slipped it. You almost slipped it. Oh my god. And you can say, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, oh no. And the next one is, I'm going to marry everyone in one month. And then you can say, 설마, 설마, 말도 안 돼, 말도 안 돼. Okay, and the next one is, I am bored. 심심해요. 심심해요. And then if you're talking to your friends, 심심해. 심심해. Okay? Good job, everyone. And let's move on to the next expression. Let's move on. Okay, the next expression is 기뻐요. 기뻐요. 기뻐요 means I am glad. I am glad. So, in this time, I am talking with you guys and meeting with you guys and hanging out with you guys. So, I, I'm very glad. And then, what are you going to say? 저는, 저는 means I am. So, 저는 기뻐요. 기뻐요. 저는 기뻐요. Okay? I am glad. 저는 기뻐요. Oh, 저는 슬퍼요. 슬퍼요 means I am sad. Sad. These say I was really, really busy, so I was a little bit sad. So I can say, Ah, oh, 저는 슬퍼요. 슬퍼요. 기뻐요. 슬퍼요. 재미있어요. 재미있어요. 재미있어요 means it's funny or it's interesting. For example, do you know the movie Parasite? Parasite, which is a very, very famous Korean movie. Uh, if you know about the parasites, I really love the movie. That movie, I watched it in a movie theater and it was like uh, really, really, I I almost, I, I was sweating while I was watching the movie because it was really amazing. I was like, I was nervous and I was like happy and I was like, oh, I really love that movie. If someone asks you, oh, how's the movie Parasite? And you really like it. And then you can say, oh, it's funny. 재미있어요. 재미있어요. You can say, parasite, 재미있어요. Parasite in Korean, by the way, parasite in Korean is 기생충. 기생충. So you can say, 기생충. 재미있어요. 재미있어요. Everyone, 기생충, parasite, 재미있어요. 재미있어요. If you haven't watched it, you should watch it. It's amazing. Oh my god. Maybe tonight I'm going to watch it. Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> I love Parasite. 
So parasite, 재미있어요. Let's move on. 행복해요, 행복해요, 행복해요 means I am happy, happy. So if you are learning Korean and you're hanging out with me and then are you happy? And then you can say 행복해요, 행복해요, 행복해요. Mm, 행복해요. I'm with Tuna, so I am 행복해요. 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 Okay, everyone, are you 행복해요? <laughs> 행복해요. And let's move on to the next one. Next one is 음, 화나요. 화나요. 화나요 is I am mad. I am angry. So, I am 화나요. Mm, I am 화나요. So, I was I was walking and someone hit me. She didn't say me. I'm sorry. He didn't say me. 미안해 to me. And I was like, 화나요. I am angry. Okay? I am angry. 화나요. 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 And let's review from the top. 기뻐요. 기뻐요. 슬퍼요. 슬퍼요. 재미있어요. 기생충, parasite, 재미있어요. 행복해요. I am happy. 행복해요. And 화나요. I'm angry. 화나요. 화나요. And then I'm going to tell you one more, which is if you are talking with your friends or with the younger people, you can delete yo, right? So you can say 기뻐. 기뻐. 슬퍼. 슬퍼. 재미있어. 재미있어. 행복해요. 행복해. 행복해. 화나. 화나. Okay? So you can use this expression without yo. Okay? Without yo. And it means that uh, you can talk with your friends or with the younger people. Okay? So these are the expressions that you can use in, when you're expressing your feeling. Good. And let's move on to the next expression. 창피해요. 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 It means I'm embarrassed. I'm ashamed. And then, I am embarrassed. Ashamed has another expression, which is, I'm going to show you two together. 부끄러워요. 부끄러워요. 창피해요. 부끄러워요. The two expression over here, they have the same meaning, which is, I'm embarrassed. I'm ashamed. So two together. You're walking on the street, and then you sing like, ah. Na, 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 dynamite. And you were singing loud. You, you thought there was no one. But actually, there are so many people in the back. You didn't know that. And then you feel embarrassed, right? And then you can say, Oh, 창피해요. Oh, 부끄러워요. Okay? Like this. I have that kind of experience, actually. I didn't know that. Let's move on. The next expression is, 무서워요. 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 So, you watch horror movie, like uh, the the person with a like, there's no, the, no head, and was like, wow, in a horror movie. And then like, oh, 무서워요, 무서워요. This expression, 무서워요, is when you watch something very scary, and then like, it's scary, it, I'm so scared. And then you can say, 무서워요, 무서워요, 무서워요. Okay, 무서워요, 무서워요. Okay, so 무서워요. And if you're talking with your friends, and you delete, yo, so, 무서워, 무서워, okay? The next one is 짜증나요, 짜증나요. 짜증나요 is, uh, it's bothering. It's, it's very irritating. So, if you want to buy something, and then you went to the machine, and you try to buy something, and it doesn't work, and there is no... Um, there is no clerk, there is no one to help me, there is no one. So he was like, oh, you want to buy this very quickly, but there is no one. I was like, oh, 짜증나, oh, 짜증나, 짜증나요, 짜증나요, okay? Irritating and bothering, and it's called 짜증나요. And then if you're talking to your friends, say, oh, 짜증나, 짜증나. This expression, we use a lot. Oh, 짜증나, 짜증나. Okay, the next one is 불안해요. 불안해요. 불안해요 is like, oh, I'm nervous. I'm anxious. I'm nervous. So, 불안해요. So, I'm anxious. So, before the test, I usually like this. 
불안해요. 불안해요. I, I'm always nervous before the test. So I was like, 불안해, 불안해, before the test. 는 불안해요. So I'm nervous. I'm anxious. Okay? So let's review from the top. So, two expression over here. I am ashamed. I'm embarrassed. 창피해요. 창피해요. 부끄러워요. 부끄러워요. And horror movie. 무서워요. 무서워요. And 짜증나요. 짜증나요. And 불안해요. Before the test. 불안해요. 불안해요. Okay? 불안해요. Good job, everyone. So, let's move on to the next expression. The next five expressions are all about the slang. So, the first slang is 노답. 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 With this expression. 헐 노답. You can put with 헐 노답. So, 노답 is two syllables together. 노. So, in English, no, no. 답 is answer. So, literally, it means no answer. No answer. If there's no result, and then you can say, 노답, 노답. So, for example, the teacher said something no not make sense. She's always shouting. Hey, you guys, you should do this. You should do that. Oh, why are you so impolite? You should do this. And then the student's like, oh, There's no answer to this teacher. And let's move on to the next one. So, and Dojem is also, you can see that. No is no. And Jem is Jemi. Do you remember the expression 재미있어요? 재미있어요. 재미있어요. Parasite 재미있어요. 재미있어요 means funny, right? So 노 재미. 재미 is the, the very short version of 재미. So it means fun. Literally, it means 노 재미. 노. 노 재미. Fun. So there's no fun. So if someone asks you, Do you know the game? Do you know the game Among Us? Do you like it? And then, if there's a friend who doesn't like Among Us, and then he can say, Ah, no jam, no jam, no jam. So there's no fun, no fun, no jam, no jam. If you really like it, you can say, Gul jam, gul jam. Gul is honey, so it's more exaggerating something. So gul is gul, gul. Tim is fun, very fun. Do you like Among Us game? And then you can say, oh, 꿀잼, 꿀잼. It means it's very, very funny. It's really, really interesting. Okay, so you can say, ah, 꿀잼, Among Us game, Among Us game, 꿀잼, 꿀잼. You should do that, 꿀잼. This is 레알. Can you guess any uh, English words which is very familiar with 레알? 레알? Leal is real. We say it in leal. So, really? If you want to say really, and then in Korean slang, we said leal? Leal, leal? 진짜? Leal, leal? Your friend said, I'm going to marry. And they're like, leal? Leal? Are you sure? Leal? And this expression is 쩐다. There is a two 지읒. Two 지읒. So it's double 지읒. And it's Pronunciation is t t t, so it has to be tonda, tonda. Oh my God, I have a perfect score, and my friend can say tonda, 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 tonda. It's you're amazing, so it's awesome. So tonda is awesome. Ah, oh, tonda, tonda, tonda. Okay, tonda, awesome, awesome. And let's move on to the last one, and it's really commonly used. It's zhang, zhang, zhang. So zhang is also double jiut. So it has to be zhang, zhang, zhang. Okay? And zhang is best, best, or super, super. Wow, super. So you're the best. 너는 zhang, 너는 zhang. So, oh, 
everyone, you're learning Korean in this time and you're really awesome. You're the best. And then you can say, everyone, 짱. Everyone who came to the Tuna live streaming and you're 짱. 짱, 짱, 짱. Okay? Everyone, you're 짱. Okay, and let's review from the top. The first one is, let's pronounce it together. Ah, 노답. That teacher is 노답. She's always shouting, 노답. And, do you like Among Us? Oh, did you like it? 노, 노잼. No funny. 노잼, no fun. 노잼. <gasps> 꿀잼, 꿀잼, 꿀잼. The next one is Are you sure? Leal? Leal? Really? Leal? Leal? It's not, we don't say real, no. It's Leal? 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 And Oh, you're awesome, everyone. Donda, donda, donda. Everyone, the last one is 너는 짱. Everyone who is watching this, 짱, 짱, 짱. Okay, everyone. So we finished the last five expression also, and we finished these all 20 expression in here. <laughs> That's amazing, everyone. That's amazing. Okay, so we finished the um, 20 expression today, and I am going to tell you some homework. So upload your studying pictures of most no expression 100 in Instagram and tag Tuna Kim one in there and then I'm gonna go there and I'm gonna do the like and comments over there 